portable devices that can be used on the battlefield now all take power, we can remove that power anxiety and power constraint. We make devices that can be folded up and put in your pocket, deployed anywhere. You make the warfighter more efficient by being able to use his handheld technology that's becoming more prevalent on the battlefield. The typical solar that you see is something you would expect to see on a rooftop or on a building, which is mono or polycrystalline, so it's made out of glass. We are the leading manufacturer of thin film SIGS solar, which is a very flexible, lightweight solar on plastic. We use a process called monolithic integration, which builds in redundancy, so our solar can take a bullet, get run over, dropped, kicked, and it still works. That resilience that we provide is something that cannot be matched. You can deploy it on your back, your chest, if you're going from point A to point B in an M razor, in a dagger, snap it to the roof, snap it to the hood. So it's got a very wide ranging applicability. The average soldier carries about probably 20 to 25 pounds of batteries. With the weight that a soldier is already carrying on his back, which is to be in the area about 100 to 130 pounds, we want to improve that by taking space, size, weight off of the back of the operator to actually make them more efficient and take the 20 to 25 pounds down to 10 to 12 pounds. What does that do to a mission? Could allow them to carry more water, food, ammo. Maybe what was a 72 hour mission now can go on for 96 hours, 120 hours. These types of events are great. One of the biggest things here at this event is the ability of the vendors and technologists to be able to engage with each other, share ideas on how can we partner, present a solution to the DOD. To come out here, it enables you to see what does the warfighter truly need and what devices are they using. The technologies here are all devices that we can help make more effective.